let's get on ready. So I'm going to show you guys my evening routine. First thing I do is after a long day, I want to cleanse my face and get rid of any like dirt that I've got from the streets, makeup. This is a product that I've started using really recently. It's called Face Halo and all you need is hot water and it takes everything off your face. Okay, so I'm gonna take my makeup off. I found that a lot of cleansers were too strong and I would get really red in my face when I use them. So this is perfect because you really don't need any product. And it even works really well for eye makeup, which is rare. I've never found something that gets rid of eye makeup this easy. There we go. All the makeup is now on here and my skin is makeup free. So my next step uh, after using the face halo is using this Lancome oil-based eye makeup remover just to get rid of any, any extra eye makeup if I have it on my face because it works really well and it's super gentle. When you use the Q-tips, you really get in there and get every single little bit of makeup out. It's easier than using a cotton pad. So now that my skin is all free from any product, I like to do a face mask from Tata Harper, I think it's called. So I, I've never used to use masks, but recently just with work and a lot of um, makeup artists have suggested different ones that will make my skin more hydrated. So that's why I use this one now since like a year back. I try to use this mask about four days a week. So while I have this uh, mask on for about 15 minutes, I this is my favorite product because it makes my skin, all of my body super soft. So I use the dry brush and I use it for about 15 minutes all of my body. So I'll start like on my arms and just go in circular motions. It kind of hurts a little bit, but you get used to it and I don't really feel it anymore. And after you've used it, your skin is so soft. It's incredible. And it also helps with cellulite and makes your skin firmer. I can't, I've been doing this for many years, so I can't even remember how it was the first time I, the first time I got into it. It was at least like five years ago. So it's been about 15 minutes now since I put the mask on. And normally what I would do is get into the shower and use my favorite uh, coffee scrub. This is just coffee grinds. And then this is coconut oil mixed with uh, cypress extract and cinnamon bark. Both of those two essential oils are supposed to help with making your skin firmer and just more beautiful. <laughs> uh, so I like to put that in my coconut oil and then I mix the coffee grinds with the coconut oil and use that in the shower. So when I was younger, I, uh, yeah, I had cellulite on my legs that I wanted to get rid of. So I did a lot of research about what was supposed to be good for that and getting smoother and uh, firmer skin. And it said everywhere that coffee was really good for that. So I kind of experimented a little bit and made my own scrub that I now use almost every day in the shower. So I'm going to rinse my mask off now. And um, yeah, I better put my hair up for that. Okay. So the mask is off and now I'm going to use my favorite serum here. So this is the Revitalift uh, serum from L'Oreal and I love this one because it's super, super hydrating. So I use a couple of drops of this. I like to mix up my skincare routine uh, every now and then. So this I've just been using recently because it's winter time right now and my skin has been super dry and this has really helped for making it more hydrated. It's really light on your skin and it sinks like right in. So the next step in my routine is this intensive moisture balance. It's a skin cream from Dermalogica and this I've been using for at least 10 years. It's my go-to, I use it every single day. So I put a lot of that on. If I have any skin irritations and I use this, it just, it helps for everything and it always when I've been without it, my skin gets a lot um, more dry and irritated 
and I feel like if I'm using this every single day, my skin is always flawless. The, if I was stranded on, a, on an island, this would be the one product I would bring for sure. A lot of the products that I use or almost everything is very, very natural and it's just happened to become that way. I, I enjoy using natural things on my skin because that's what's felt the best for me. So after this, I have, it's a lip balm from Sweden that I get every time I'm in Sweden. It's just really, really good for, for your lips. It makes them soft and I like to put it on every morning, every evening and I always keep it in my handbag but it's really good. So if you're in Sweden, you should get this at the chemist there. So after all of that, I have a glass or a drink of water with ba baobab. I think that's how you pronounce it, baobab. And they come in these cute little packs and I bring them everywhere, try to have it every night. And it's good for your skin. It's got a ton of antioxidants and vitamins and it's all natural. The only ingredient is baobab. So I like to use a packet of this and mix it in with some water. So this tastes really good uh, compared to a lot of other superfoods out there. Uh, so yeah, I have it every single night, at least once a day. I feel like it prevents, prevents me from getting sick, but that might just be in my head. So that's ready. And it tastes a bit like stra strawberries and lemon. So it's not that bad. So uh, after the baobab, I like to have some aronia berries. I don't have these every single night, but if I feel like I'm gonna get a cold or if I feel like just not great, then I'll have these because they're a huge source of calcium, vitamin C, antioxidants. It's like all good things are in here. So I'll have like a handful of these. And as well, these, these don't taste bad. They taste pretty good, like a sour blueberry. You don't even need any more because they're so, so rich in vitamins and minerals. So right before I go to bed, after I've done all of this, I like to have this little packet of Rishi Mushroom Elixir, which I also mix in with water. This one doesn't taste as good, but it's supposed to be super healthy and good for you. So yeah, the Rishi Mushroom Elixir has helped me with not waking up during the nights anymore. Now I can't live without it. I have it every single night before I go to bed. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do right now. Good night.